Samuel appointed his sons, Joel and Abijah, as Israel's leaders, but they did not follow his ways and turned to dishonest gain. The elders of Israel gathered at Ramah and asked Samuel to appoint a king to lead them, like all other nations have. Samuel prayed to the Lord, who told him that the people had rejected him as their king. He warned them of the king's rights, which included taking their sons, daughters, fields, vineyards, olive groves, grain, servants, cattle, donkeys, and flocks, and making them slaves. Samuel told the people that the king would take their sons, daughters, fields, vineyards, olive groves, grain, servants, cattle, and donkeys, and make them slaves. The people refused to listen to Samuel, stating that they wanted a king to lead them and fight their battles. When Samuel heard the people's pleas, the Lord answered by saying, listen to them and give them a king. Samuel then instructed the Israelites to return to their own towns.